world suffered a great loss last year. One of television's best naturalists, Steve Irwin, aka the Crocodile Hunter, was killed during a shoot of his popular Discovery Channel series. So now I've called out to find the next Crocodile Hunter. You've submitted your best Steve Irwin impersonations, and now we will find the star of our new series. What we have right here is a prime example of a California king snake. We're gonna watch him eating in his not so natural habitat. Oh, whack! Look at him, he caught that sucker good! He's a constrictor type of snake, which means he caught this, the mouse and he's gonna squeeze the life right out of him. Look at his eyeball, it looks like it's gonna pop right out of his head. You can see a little blood where the mouse actually bit the snake. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! There he is! Oh! Oh! See that? Oh! This is it! This is the monster I've been looking for, everybody! This is the monster! Oh! I hurt myself on this little excursion, but that's okay. So as long as I get this baby to safety, I'm gonna take him to a nice spot where nobody can harm him because we cannot harm animals, it's not good. This is, our, this is the way of life. We cannot, we cannot move this beast from its habitat, even though it's rare. This is the northeastern section of the United States of America on the Palisades Cliffs. Look at the skyline. Don't be fooled, everybody out there walking, looking at these buildings with your fucking head straight up high, like this. Look at that, New York is beautiful. Bam, you get bit by a snake right in the fucking subway. It can happen to you. Don't let it happen. Crikey, you can see that beast over there. You can see right into his eyes. They're pure evil. Wow, Steve Irwin has definitely made an impact. Those were some great impersonations. Keep submitting those clips and you could be the next Crocodile Hunter.